Here we go. Here we go. It's time for Splatfest. Which do you like better, cats or dogs? Head over to the pledge box and pick a side. I already did. Oh my goodness gracious, those look so nice. Uh, but we're on Team Cats. Holy moly, Team Cats though, that's where we're at. The Splatfest results are in. Oh, here we go guys. First, we'll reveal which team was more pop was most popular. Come on. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Bada bada -ba wait for it, I'm waiting. What? What? Why were dogs more popular? 62% of people chose dogs over cats? What? That doesn't make any sense. We're gonna lose. What the hell? Wins, time to see which team won the most battles. Bring it on. Here we go. Here we go, wait for it. Yeah, cats win the most battles. What does that mean? What does that mean? No hard feelings either. Either way, yeah, and finally, the final results. Final results. Uh, winning team is Splatfest. It's gonna be dogs. What? Ah, oh, that's how they do it? Okay, well, man, all right. And uh, it's great news, I joined Team Roller Coaster. Hold on to your tentacles. All right, here we go. The Splatfest results are in. Ooh. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. Let's see, let's see, let's see, wait for it. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Ah, gee, you know, I knew it. I knew water slides was gonna be more popular just because of, ah, because of everyone like in like the lobby areas and stuff. Okay. Ah, uh, we lost. Yay. <laughs> Time to see which team won the most battles. Bring it on. All right, let's find out, let's find out. Wait for it. Ooh, 53, yeah, yeah, we won the most battles. Of course we did. I w yeah, you saw my performance. What does that equate to, though? Uh, yeah, I don't know, what does that equate to? What's the math, no hard feelings either way, yeah? And finally, the final results. All right, come on, How? Did, how did, is it the same math? I can't do the math quickly in my head. Yes, yeah, times two on those, okay. Oh, that was close. We won! Roller Coaster won! Yes! Yes, victory coast to coast, baby! Er, the coasters win the, the, the mosters. Here we go. Would you rather roast a marshmallow or a hot dog? Head over to the pledge box and pick a side. Ro a hot dog roasting a marshmallow, I love it! I love that one, a hot dog roasting a marshmallow. Perfect. Oh, Team Marshmallow. No, it's Team Hot Dog. Uh-oh. The Splatfest results are in. Ooh. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. Here we go. Marshmallow or Hot Dog? I'm gonna guess Marshmallow is more popular. Let's see it. Oh my god, no! That's like insurmountable! Oh my gosh! 64%? Oh, what? Time to see which team won the most battles. Bring it on. I don't think that's, unless it's like amazing. Uh, let's see what the final results are. They switched it to, instead of a third popularity contest, it's like a fifth popularity contest. So, Team Hot Dog lost. Congratulations, Team Marshmallow. All right, Transformers. <laughs> More than meets the eye. On one side, the legendary heroes of Cybertron, Autobots. And on the other side, uh, the baddest evil robots ever, Decepticons. So, um, I'm gonna pick Team Autobots. I mean, I like the Autobots better. Yes, uh, the results for the Splatfest, the Transformers Splatfest. And I'll tell you guys right now, I know the results. I was too anxious, I looked them up. So I know, so any surprise that I give you right now will be a little bit, uh, you know, feigned. So here we go, the Splatfest results are in. Popularity. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. It's gonna be, well, I know what it's gonna be. Here we go. Boom, Autobots, 58% popularity compared to Decepticons with 42% popularity. Which won the most battles? Now, I personally did, for every game that I played, totaled up, I did better than 50%. So, but let's see how they did here. Autobots won, guess what? 
44%. And that counts as four-fifths of the total score. So, we lost. Autobots lost. Decepticons, congratulations. You won. Um, no hard feelings either way, yeah? And finally, the final results, yeah. So, we already know the final results because if you do the math in your head quickly, it's times four for the wins. So 234 to 266, congratulations Decepticons, Autobots tried their best, I especially tried my best. Um, Decepticons annihilate, Oh man. Which is more important, art or science? Head over to the pledge box and pick a side. I've already chosen Team Science. The Splatfest results are in, ooh. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. Here we go. Wait for it. 51% art. Boom, boom. I thought they were pretty, you know, equal just based on me playing. Uh, I didn't really have, if anything, I thought art was actually way more popular. Never mind. I did. I didn't think art was way more popular. Which one of the most battles? 51% art. I thought science would have it. I mean, I had like plus 19 in terms of streak. So, Art, congratulations, Team Art. You won the Splatfest. No hard feelings either way. Yeah, and finally, the final results. We know. We know the final results. We know. There's no There's no more. Yeah, we know. There you go. Boom. Ten points ahead. How would you rather travel, by car or plane? Have, head over to the pledge box and pick a side. And let's go in. Team Cars is where it's at. And um, so let's do it. Here we go. The Splatfest results are in. Ooh. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. Or <laughs> probably said it differently. All right, wait for it. Oh. <laughs> no surprise there. Okay. <laughs> Plane was a lot more popular. Man, I know we did not win because it was just so impossible. I won so few that it just like, I just know. Okay, wait for it, ba da 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 ba ba All right, 54 to 46. I don't know if that's enough though to put us over the top. That's not a very, very great win. We'll see. No hard feelings either way. And finally, the final results. I can't do math in my head like this. Let's do it. Here we go. That's such a big gap. Oh, what? 252 to 248 with Team Car winning? Here we go, which do you like better, pirates or ninjas? Head over to the pledge box and pick a side. Uh, so I feel like I would be a ninja over a pirate. I know that, here's the thing though, ninjas take a lot of work to be, you can just be a pirate. You can just get a parrot, get a peg leg, be a pirate, no big deal. Ninjas take like decades of training, <laughs> things like that. And so uh, I'm gonna go with team ninjas this time around. I'm gonna join them. And, uh, I mean, if you read the news stories, you don't hear stories about ninjas killing people. You hear stories about pirates kidnapping and killing people. So, I'm going to go with Team Ninja. I got a new Splatfest tee. I'm wearing it right now. I have nothing uh, updated, but we're going to go ahead and go in. The Splatfest results are in. Ooh. And I know the results already because uh, I saw Twitter. They tweeted them out. I know I know the results, and I did the math, and it what they actually changed. We'll see. We'll see. The popularity, look at this. Look at this. This, this is no surprise. 72% popularity, ninjas versus pirates. Oh, we lost. Yay. <laughs> Next up, quickly, quickly. So look at this. Here we go. This is wins now. 59% wins. And you would think with the big popularity, that's like no big deal. But if you take a look, take a look at this. They multiply it by six, and they, that's a new result right here. They have the popularity, and then they multiply the wins by six. It used to be multiplied by four, so 382 to th uh, 318. Pirates win, congratulations, Team Pirate. Uh, Team Ninja lost. Uh, I spent forever with this Splatfest, so I'm a little bit disappointed. Uh, even with the times four multiplier, Ninjas would have lost, so I did what I could do. Burgers versus pizza. Which do you like better, burgers or pizza? Head over to the pledge box and pick a side. You know, I couldn't really decide which one to pick. I'm gonna pick Team Burgers. I know it's not as popular. That could be a good thing though. I'm gonna, I'm gonna join Team Burgers. And uh, it's just like sometimes I'm in a burger mood, sometimes I'm in a pizza mood. Today I'm in a burger mood. But the Splatfest results are in popularity. <laughs> You're never, <laughs> this is no surprise who's the most popular. Uh, but guess who? Guess who? Wait for it, it says. How long do you guys want to wait for it? 
It's just until I press A is how long you guys are going to be waiting for it. <laughs> All right, it's pizza with 63% popularity, but thanks to... Uh, you know, good old math. <laughs> it, <laughs> it's not all about popularity. Yay! So, I was Team Burger, of course, as you know. Next up, though, quickly, quickly, here are the wins. The uh, the skill level, the win level uh, of the overall teams. Let's see who did it. I, I'm, I don't know why I'm drawing this out, but I am. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Wait for it. Wait for it. 56% victory compared to 44%. All right, that's pretty good. But in total, you know there's a time six multiplier. She's like, uh, no hard feelings either way. Yeah, and finally, the final results. Here we go, the final results. The winning results. Are we ready for this? Are we ready for this, guys? <laughs> I don't know why I'm dragging it out. Okay, here we go. All right, there you go, time six equals 373 to 327. Team Burger takes the victory right there. Here we go. Have you been naughty or nice this year? Head over to the pledge box and pick a side. Which one do you think it is? A naughty queen. Yes, I want to be a naughty queen. Um, <laughs> don't quote me on that. But here we go. Popularity, naughty versus nice. Who was most popular? Let's find out. You guys probably already know this. Nice was most popular. Lots of kids trying to appeal to Santa, I guess. It's up to skill now. Let's find out what it's going to be. Here we go. Which team won the most battles? We got this. Come on. Yes, Naughty won the most battles. So what does that mean for us? I think it means... I think you know what it's going to mean. It's going to mean something awesome, most likely. Let's see what we got. No hard feelings. Uh, the final results. I think you guys know. It's going to be skill times six. Wins times six. There we go. We won Splatfest. Team Naughty won Splatfest. I was a Naughty Queen, so I'm going to get all those sea snails. Uh, I expect the future technology to be awesome. Going back to see the dinosaurs would be cool, but I feel like in the future we'll be able to clone dinosaurs. So either way, let's go with future sign. I'm sure everyone's picking this. Yes, really. The Splatfest results are in. Ooh. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. I think it was future because we got a lot of future versus future battles. So let's see what the stats are. I don't even know this. I did not look at it myself. 61%. Boom. It's all going to come down to uh, how well we did, though. It really is. Let's see. Wins, wins, wins. Who did it? Who did it? Who did it? 55. That's close. Is it? How close, though? How close? Does it all come down to wins? Final results? Oh, it's a time six. Mmm. 369 to 331. Pokemon! Pokemon presents a Splatfest that will finally settle an old score. Did you go for the cover with the hot Charizard? Pokemon Red? Or did you realize that Blast Toys is way cooler? Pokemon Blue? In my opinion, B Dog is cooler than C Dog. At least I, I go for B Dog a lot more often. I'll tell you right now, I'm gonna go for Blue. For B Dog, right there. The Splatfest results are in. Ooh. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. Let's find out. Now, I did have a few blues versus blues. I think that was mostly network thing, but let's see. Okay. 55% more popular was the uh, red. So uh, they won in popularity. But it's up to skill. Time six to see who won. So let's see what we got here. Time to see which team won the most battles. Bring it on. Yeah, bring it on, dude. Here we go. But I uh, wait for it. We're waiting. Boom. 59%. I think that means blue wins. No. <laughs> no hard feelings either way. Yeah, and finally, the final results. Here we go. The winner of Splatfest is... I'm pretty sure it's blue based on that. Heck yes. Yes. 399 to 301. Blue wins. I get to pick up my sea snails. Yes, Pokemon Blue wins. Water gun. Drum roll, please. Snowman versus Sandcastle. I'd rather build a snowman or I'd rather build a sandcastle. Builders unite and then divide. Would you rather build a guy out of frozen water, a snowman, or build a medieval fortress out of tiny rocks, a sandcastle? Uh, I'm going to choose sandcastle, and I'll tell you why. Uh, because... Building a snowman requires you to be out in the cold. 
That's not my style. I get really cold. I have to wear gloves and stuff, and I get so cold building a snowman. Plus, it doesn't even snow that much here where I live. The results for snowman versus sandcastle. As you know, I was on team sandcastle. Let's see the results right here. Popularity. Let's, how does it break down? Let's see. Ooh, Snowman was a little more popular, not too much more popular, which is actually surprising. I thought Sandcastle would be more popular because we had a lot of Sandcastle versus Sandcastle going on. So uh, let's see about uh, skill, though, in terms of wins. Who was it? Oh, Sandcastle, and I think that's just barely enough so that Sandcastle wins overall the final results. Along, assuming that wins are multiplied by six, they are. There we go, victory for Team Sandcastle. Team Sandcastle wins, no. Do you know what it is, guys? It's SpongeBob versus Patrick. Who do you want? Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. I can't hear you. Aye, aye, Captain. All right, the Splatfest results are in. Popularity, first we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. <laughs> maybe I maybe said it not how she meant it. SpongeBob was more popular. Hmm. I found that hard to believe because it was always Patrick versus Patrick for me. But now that they've divided it, like divided it by skill level, uh, it could be that the more skilled players chose Patrick over SpongeBob, and then that's why there was a lot of Patrick versus Patrick. But anyway, oh yeah, oh man. Next up, quickly, quickly. All right, most battles. Bring it on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That's that's us. That's uh, probably a times six multiplier. All right, let's see what happens. I think that means we win. I don't want to jump the gun. Oh yeah, we won. Yeah, we won. There we go. Team Patrick wins another splat fest under my belt. I would rather join a fancy costume party like Eyes Wide Shut, but I can only choose one, so it's going to be the fancy party. I don't know about costumes, man. Sometimes costumes can be a little weird, a little scary. Um, I heard who won, but I don't know what the results are. So uh, here we go, the most popular. The thing is, is since they segregated the skilled players from like you know the, the newer players, it's hard to determine which is most popular just by playing. Okay, Fancy was more popular. Interesting. I cannot believe that, actually. I assume Costume is going to be the most popular. So congratulations, Team Fancy, for popularity. But let's see who, what the skill level was, because I was up against... Well, at the same time, I, I didn't do too well on Team Fancy, but I was up against a lot of really skilled Team Fancy. So let's see what it's like right now. Here we go. Wait for it. Ooh, the close. this is like the closest Splatfest ever. Holy cow. Holy moly, the final results, but well, we know since Fancy won both of them that Fancy's gonna be the victor, which means I get my sea snails, which is awesome. But that was a really close splat fest. Really, probably one of the closest I've ever seen. Night Owl has been joined. There we go, let's do it. I like the colors of Night Owl, the purple. I mean, they, they really nailed it on the colors this time. The, the ink is gonna be great. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. I bet Night Owl was most popular. Let's see, though. This is my guess. We're waiting for it. Whoa, really popular. Oh my gosh. Ugh. That spells bad news for me because Early Bird might be more skilled. It's mostly going to come down to skill, I think. Let's see what happens. All right, who, who did better? Who won the most battles? Come on, who did it? We did what? We won. <laughs> I can't believe we won. That's so cool, we won battles and we won in popularity. That's so cool. No hard feelings either way. Yeah, and finally, the final results, well, we know who won. I kind of wish I went further with it. Uh, I only went to like Defender, so that's okay with me. We won big time. Let's see which team I join. I know which team I'm joining, but I'm gonna leave you in suspense for a little bit. Team Callie, yay, or Team Marie Boo, head over to the pledge box and pick my side. <laughs> Splatfest teams, I'm gonna do it. Team Marie! Join, yeah, let's join right now. Here we go. The Splatfest results are in. Ooh. First, we'll reveal which team was most popular. Come on. I'm gonna say Marie was most popular because I had some Marie versus Marie battles. Let's see. Boom, boom. 50, yeah, she was, 54% to 46%. But it's gonna be really all about skill. Let's see what ends up happening. Oh, we lost. Yay. <laughs> Next up. Quickly, quickly. Time to see which team won the most battles. Bring it on. 
Here we go. Which team won the most battles? Yes! <laughs> yes! Team Marie won! Yes! No! Hee <laughs> hee! No hard feelings either way, yeah? And finally, the final results. But we know, we know because she won both categories, popularity and skill. So here we go. Come on, come on. We got the true results now. Way to go, Marie. Popularity and wins, 340 to 360. Holy carp.